Hey guys, ZeroTech00 Zero Zero here, and today we are gonna test the Asset Antivirus versus the Deadly.exe virus, so I hope you guys will enjoy this video and let's get straight into it. Okay guys, so the first test will be running the Deadly.exe virus but with all the Asset Antivirus protections enabled, so I'm gonna run now the Deadly.exe virus with everything enabled in 3, 2, 1. And as you guys can see, the acid antivirus has detected and removed and I guess blocked the deadly.exe virus. So with that, I guess we can get now further into the second test. Okay guys, so the second test will be running the deadly.exe virus but with the acid antivirus's uh, hips protection disabled as you, can, as you guys can see here, it's disabled. And yeah, all the protections are uh, enabled except for this one. So I'm gonna run out the Deadly.exe virus without the hips protection in 3, 2, 1. And as you guys can see, the Deadly.exe virus has got detected and stopped and removed once again by the set antivirus. So with that, once again, we can move on into the third test. Okay guys, so the third test will be running the Deadly.exe virus once again but with the real-time file system protection disabled only. So, uh, we are gonna run out the Deadly.exe virus with this protection disabled in 3, 2, 1. And unfortunately, as you guys can see, we got unfortunately infected. When you disable that protection, it seems like uh, it said becomes weak. And there we go. Yeah, this malware is a bit strange. Not gonna lie. But yeah, that's what happens. Uh, now, I'm gonna restart, yeah, Control shift escape don't, doesn't work here, so yeah, I guess I'm gonna restart the system and we are gonna see the final result, since we can't do anything, yeah, okay, let's restart the system and see the final result, and yeah, as I expected, and as you guys can see, the system got destroyed. Not gonna lie, this was one of my most fastest video I've ever made, because this set really failed this fast. Yeah, uh, at least it did good in two tests, you know, in the first two tests. Unfortunately, it failed in this third one, but at least it passed those two ones. What can I say? My conclusion is that if you disable the main protection of this antivirus, uh, your system will pretty much be very vulnerable to malware. So don't do that. Also, always uh, keep all your protections enabled and uh, be careful of what you are downloading and all this stuff. As I said, don't pirate games or apps or anything like that, buy them for your safety. And yeah, as a final result, because I forgot to mention that, the final winner is obviously the Deadly.exe virus. So yeah, it's a bit disappointing for the set antivirus, but any AV can fail at the third or at the last test, because those ones are very difficult. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. See ya and stay healthy and see you guys next time. And now uh, let's get the shout out for the YouTube members.